We are on Taggart Road. This is the first time we've been on it. It reopened, I think, last week for the first time since the accident. You could see the creek that was around here is all dried up. We're still in Pennsylvania. still has water in it. You see we're coming into Ohio. Oh, there's a person. Hi person. No. <laughs> and we're still cleaning and this is State Line Tavern. It's been closed since the accident, of course. My goodness, there's a lot of people stops and goes. They dry off and wash the trucks after each one is loaded, apparently. Here's the gas station that they almost ran into in Propane Place. You can see back through there is where like, the wreck was. And then this building up here with the blue roof, you've seen on a lot of drone videos. Oh, that's where like the EPA and the CDC and people set up there on the hill. And this, these people put millions of dollars into this building and then the train like bashes into them. And then here. There's a little group of houses that the railroad should have bought immediately, condemned and tore down because this stuff is right in these people's backyard. And one of these houses is where the lady who was just arrested for stealing $18,000 from the railroad and reimbursements lives. And still more people. And there's the railroad crossing down by where we would live.